Hello everybody and welcome back to our Redstone channel, I'm your host Spiral Cell and today we are back with another banger. In today's episode we will be playing Jurassic World Evolution 2 again and this episode we are going through episode 2 of our Every Single Species Park. I know I haven't uploaded since last week and I do deeply apologise for that even though I did say that the uploads will be coming back um, how they used to, I do uh, deeply apologise. Um, but they will be getting back on it this week, and that is a promise. We have got some bangers lined up for you this week, um, including some pre-recorded uh, footage of this park. So, uh, yeah, make sure you stay tuned for that. But anyway, let's go over what we've done in the last episode. In the last episode, we've done this little section right here, as you can see in the back. That was our like herbivore classic herbivore section so that includes like the brachiosaur, triceratops, stegosaurs, uh, parasols, uh, you know just the basics um, but anyway in this episode we want to focus on more of the carnival side of things um, that uh, you'll get to see in this episode so here I'm just brainstorming ideas as I didn't really have anything planned or what to do here and I just didn't really know so I was originally going to add a uh, lagoon like kind of sunken down but I didn't really like the look of it so we didn't go with it but instead we end up going with more of an uphill design instead as you can see here we are currently raising the uh the height of the uh, enclosure well not the enclosure the way the enclosures will be uh we had a total of three new species maybe four three or four new species in this episode which isn't a lot i know and we should be adding more um but you know we need to start somewhere so next episode we will be either focusing on the um what's it called the marine reptiles or the um flying reptiles now it's i'm not really sure what i'm gonna go with i'm gonna go with the uh lagoons instead because of the update that came out i haven't really tested it because i haven't been playing Jurassic world all that much so we'll probably get into some of the newer species in the lagoons so stick around for that episode but anyway what i'm doing here is i'm adding a little rock wall because i wanted to see what this would turn out like as i've never really done it before but you know may as well test something out while we're here as you can see i'm just slightly adding a bit of, well not slightly i'm adding quite a few rocks going around i didn't really like that color so i switched up to the white i do end up changing that one odd one out there as you can see there um i will be starting up a new arc series as well soon only a small one though because you know uh yeah we don't want it to go too big it'll be one of the custom ma maps so like something like lost island most likely um but yeah as you can see i'm like just filling in the blanks anyway we're gonna speed this up a little um but please excuse the frame rate it will drop a little turns out i was also using the wrong microphone so the mic quality has increased but the video quality has decreased yeah uh I know it's not amazing, like the video quality, but you know what, you just got to deal with it. It's in full time speed, um, and it's a, the frame rate is a little, a little jittery, right? But here's me working on the first enclosure anyway. This will be home to the, ah, oh, what I put in you? I even forgot what we put in you, so we'll see in just a bit. So I went with kind of a little weird shape and I went with the ginkgo trees, because the ginkgo trees look the nicest in my opinion. I'm also adding little spots or viewing galleries to go in, because obviously you need your guests to somehow see your creatures. And here I am on the other side as well, placing a little bit more. You can copy my design if you really want, um, I won't hold you for it or anything. Um, so feel free if you want to go with any designs that I see in this park. Uh, all three use blah blah blah. You don't. I don't know why. Um, that it wouldn't be. It's literally just a game. But anyway, I end up going with what creature do I go with here? It'll spark to me. It'll come to me. The Changesaurus. That is what goes in you. Oh. Huh. Sorry guys. I've had a few messages. Let me just reply to these quick. Anyway, so, my bad. Anyway, as you can see here, I'm going around the enclosure with some pathways. And, uh, yeah. So, I tried to add a hotel, but I think no, because it, it, it won't really suit this area. Um, 
Yeah. So I didn't end. I end up scrapping the ideas of the uh, hotels, but I end up putting a few bushes in there from the Alpine. I think it is the Al. Is it the Alpine? It might be the Alpine um, biome. Um, but anyway, so I start extending on a little bit of this uh, little section up here to try and add something cool, like a little section for a dinosaur. Um, and I couldn't really get this right, so I end up scrapping it eventually. Um, and I just couldn't really be happy with it. So I end up scrapping this idea instead, as you'll see in just a sec. <laughs> you just have to watch me... Uh, brainstorm a sec yeah anyway as you can see I have clearly given up on this so now we're gonna add the next attraction on we're gonna expand out this way just a little as you can see here I will be showing a slow down version at the end of this so don't you worry and you can get a full on overview of the park um, so I'm now adding the second part of the park yeah of course you can see it's a bit of a weird shape but I like going with weird shapes because I don't want the, the enclosure to be perfectly symmetrical um, because what would be the fun in that? Um, but anyway, I also plan on doing stuff like um, putting in a what's it called? A T-Rex kingdom from the film. I, want, I found a video on how to like perfectly replicate it so I do want to go back and look at that in a bit. Um, and I will be putting that in the next few episodes. I hope to get this done within the next maybe two weeks. I'm hoping so in the next six episodes. I hope, or maybe oh, it'll, ask, it'll probably take longer than six episodes to be honest. But you know what? If it gets done before then, I'll be happy. Um, I also used uh, the redwood looking trees. I forgot what they're actually called. And in here we end up going with the one, the only Allosaurus. Um, but I do just randomize the skin, and I don't use any. Um, oh, sorry. Oh, hiccups, man. I don't end up going with any specific um, color variation. I just randomize it, and I didn't get to use the uh, what's it called, the twenty twenty two version. Um, but you know what? It's all good. It's all good. The battle of big rock. Yeah, no, we don't. We don't need it. But anyway, I'm going through this enclosure now, adding a bit of rocks everywhere. And to be honest, I was quite happy with the way this um, little enclosure turned out. It turned out like it wasn't an amazing shape. I won't lie to you but I'm pretty happy with it. So anyway, I go ahead to add the visitor center um, from Jurassic World, just because, you know, we need something to uh, lighten up the mood a little. Just uh, something up here, so people have another reason to come up here. Um, but the only thing I'm finding out now, what I'm gonna be struggling with in this park is how to connect things from other things. If you know what I mean, how to connect one attraction from the other. Like obviously not the way, as in you need paths to connect them. It's like how to connect them with the path, how to make it look good. So um, expect me to be brainstorming over that for the next few episodes. Um, but yeah, yeah, <laughs> I don't know what to say now. Um, sorry, I got to stay hydrated, man. I am so warm, you don't understand. Um, but anyway, here I am and a few planters because you know we gotta have a few planters to make it look complete. I have to have the Jurassic Park gate on the Jurassic World. Um, What's it called? I forgot what it's called. Attraction. That's the one. Oh, sorry, this water's really good. Is it good? What is it? It's uh, strawberry flavored water. That's really nice. So what I do now is I'm I, I end up adding one last enclosure to this species that goes in you. I can't remember. I actually can't remember. So we we'll have to figure this out for both of us. I don't think it's ma it's definitely a medium. A medium carnival. Uh, that's the theme up here. Medium carnivals, like a few of them, and I think that's like pretty much all that'll be up here. Oh no, I remember. It is a large carnival that goes in here, and you will end up seeing it. It is the Mr. Acrocanthosaurus. I honestly thought it was a medium that goes in here, but turns out it was uh, a large, which I'm very surprised about because you know. They would literally just, uh, it was literally only medium, so I thought I'd put a wasco. May, may as well spruce it up a little. I know I am waffling at this point, but you know, 
Uh, we can start slowing this gameplay down in just a second for you all. So here I am customizing the colors I want on two different camera sources. So you gotta have two. You can't just leave them on this own unless it's something like Indominus Rex, which we will have to add, add. And I will try and make as many movie accurate enclosures as possible. So we will probably have, end up having two different enclosures. Just for the Velociraptor, there are probably more than two for the Velociraptor only because of how many variants there are. And if you're wondering, did the camera quality just change? Yes, it did because I did just slow it down a little uh, to two times speed instead. Um, now, this video is about to wrap up, and this was the whole building process. I'll let you have a quick look at the Acro skin that I like. This is the galaxy looking skin, and this is the enclosure it's in. So, let me give you a quick overview of what we've done today with some cinematic shots now uh yeah anyway guys that is how i want to end off this episode with some overview shots of what we've done today i know commentary wasn't amazing but it's never going to be amazing you're watching me by the, at the end of the day and i will try and improve on this this is my goal for the end of the year to become better at commentary for videos um but let me stop rambling again it's not helping but anyway uh, stay tuned for the next episode because next episode will be a banger um, with the species we add in and also stay alert from some new ARC content as well which will be coming out soon and uh, on the release of ASA expect some videos on that because there will be some coming now anyway uh, love you all see you in a bit goodbye